hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to learn how to create a gmail app password okay so what we are going to do with this gmail app password so this gmail app password is used for uh, configuring with our php mailer or swift mailer or any other mailer that we are going to use for sending mails in our custom website okay so now guys let us get started so first step guys to create the app password you have to log into your gmail account and once logged in you can just find this google apps here on this you can see the first icon that is about the account so let's click on it and you reach to a next tab and here you will find some options that is home personal info and etc okay so now let's move on the security part so on this security part you will find the two-step verification here so make sure you are enabled the two-step verification so once two-step verification is enabled you'll find the app password thing okay so if you don't find the app password option here then you can just directly search for the app password from the search box okay so app password if you search so here you see that app password option is shown so now let's click on that app password okay so it is asking for your so now guys let's paste and click on next so done so now guys you get a option for adding your app password so now guys here is a app name so once you enter your app name the app password will be generated so for example let's tell uh, i want to create this app password based on the tutorial so funda uh, app gmail okay so i'll keep a app name and make sure you copy these details guys so make sure you are pasting that in a notepad and saving it because later you won't get the app password so now get back and let's click on create here okay and your app password for your device so this will be your app password guys okay so now make sure you copy it once you click done you will not get this you have to delete the app and then recreate another app password okay so i will copy and paste here so this will be my app password okay now get back and click done that's it guys so you have created a app password and we will be using this app password in the next tutorial that how to use this app password for sending mail in php or html or any other code okay done so now we can get back and that's it you are set guys so guys in this video that's it and let's continue next video with the new topic that is about how to use this app password for sending an email from your website okay so thank you for watching this video guys please subscribe like and share